this is Jared the snake catcher, and it is the very day after I broke my personal snake length record with a 61 and a half inch rat snake. Today is the 1st of October. It's about the same temperature as yesterday, which proved to be a good snake day. So I'm going to see if I can find even more today. I just kind of ran out of daylight last time. But I got plenty of it today. Alright, right off the bat here, under this rock, I found this snake right here. It's a prairie king snake. I do not find these very often. This is the first one of the year, and it's in October. I've only caught four of these. This one's not too big. They can get a nice size, though, but uh, it's a really nice find. I had no expectations of finding one here. I usually find garter snakes here, but uh, it's a really nice prairie king snake. Not trying to bite. These guys are pretty docile. They're constrictors, and they're known for eating other snakes, so... If this guy's here, I don't really expect to find garter snakes, but uh, it's a really cool find. These guys are really strong. And if you can tell, he's kind of got a problem on the front of his face there. Kind of looks a little mashed in almost. But uh, otherwise, he's in real good shape. So I'm going to get the measurements. And I'll put him back, but uh, it's a real nice find. Haven't found one of these in a while. Here's just a really good look at this prairie king snake. I thought I'd give him another close up because I don't find these very often. They're really cool. See the uh, he's these are usually this is the typical color for them. Kind of a darkish color with darker brown spots. They're really docile. I've never had one of these be aggressive before. They're kind of shy. That's why you don't see them very often. This one, this one's really slithering around my hands. But uh, here's just a really good look at him. Okay, so this area is proving to be really productive today. I found another rat snake completely different location than the one where I found the 61 and a half incher last night. That's a separate YouTube video. This one's clearly not as long, probably more about three, or two or three feet. Still a real nice find. I mean, this is actually really cool. I have never found a king snake and a rat snake both in the same area before. In fact, the rock I lifted this one under, the king snake was already moving towards that rock, so... That's really cool. You could tell my hand's kind of dirty because I had to dig him out of the dirt there. He tried to get away, and I don't catch these too often, and one this size, I'm not going to let get away that easy. So, and he, As you just saw, he just looked right at the camera. These are pretty docile. Like In some areas, they kind of have a bad reputation of being mean, but uh, the ones I find around here usually aren't that nasty. So... Two really good, not common finds in a row. So, uh, I'm definitely happy no matter what happens the rest of this day. I'm going to measure this one. The king snake was 33 inches, by the way. Whoa, he just opened his mouth at the camera. He's really stretching out on me now, but, uh, I'm going to measure him and then put him back and, uh, hopefully find some more here because clearly this area is the place to be right now.